Okay, here we are, continuing drops in the bucket. This will be number six through ten. On number six, it's the vocabulary concepts and facts. So on the left-hand side of that, you'll have some choices over here. And you choose one or the other if there are two choices for the answers. So for instance, on this one, A says the bottom number of a fraction is called the... Is it going to be mile or inch, pound or ounce, equal minute, hour, denominator? It's called the denominator. So I would write that over here, and then I'm done with that. I will not use that again. B, the four sides of a square must be blank length. Must be mile length, inch length, no, must be equal length. So I just write that over here and cross it out. C, 5,280 feet is the same as, that would be one mile, one inch, one pound, one ounce, actually one mile. So since I use mile and I write that over here, I'm not going to use inch at all. Um, continuing on, you use, for instance, when you add, the answer can be called the, if we're adding, is the answer a pound or an ounce, a minute, hour, total, difference? It's called the total. So I'd write total and then I just cross that one out because I won't use those. And then I'd use that to answer the last questions there. On number seven, it's fractional parts. When we're looking at a fraction and we want to know what half of six is, in fractions, half of six, if we can do that, divide number by two. If we're looking for a half, we divide it by two. Six divided by two. If we're looking for one-third of six, we would take six divided by three. We could also color in. There's six. I'm looking for half of them. One out of every two. Let's do that one, not that one. That one, not that one. That one, not that one. I've done one out of every two, and I get three. So do that with those. Um, you may either, if it's halves, divide by two. If it's thirds, divide by three. If it's fourths, divide by four. The thing gets tricky when we get to what is three-fourths of twelve. You can draw the picture coloring in every three out of four. Color, 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 blank. Color, 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 blank. Color, 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 blank. That's three out of every four, which gets nine. Or, because I want to divide it into fourths, I do twelve divided by 4 equals 3, and I have 3 of those. 3 threes. 3 times 3 equals 9. So you would divide by the bottom and times by the top. That is fractional parts. Number 8, the place value and numeration. You guys do so awesome at that. Um, the only thing is on E, it will try to trick you sometimes. Say, write the smallest three-digit number. I get a lot of students doing that. Is one the smallest digit? No. But we can't have zeros there, because if that's a zero, that's not a number. Sorry about that. However, 100 is. Three digits. One digit, two digits, and three digits. Okay. Number nine, sometimes it's clocks, sometimes it's other things. Um, yeah. Remember on this that there are only 60 minutes in one hour. So if it's 3.15 and it says, what is, asks, what is the time in 45 minutes? So we're adding 45 minutes, and we get 3 hours and 60 minutes. Just remember that 60 minutes converts over to one hour. Then we have four hours and zero minutes, which is four o'clock. On number ten, with rulers, I have a video on measurement, reading rulers. Um, please refer to that as well. I'll do it really quickly. I'm going to be divided into eighths. Let's just say two and three. And it may say A is right here and B is right here. Okay. These are the whole numbers. It is between 2 and 3. So A is at 2 and it's divided into 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 parts. So A equals 
oops, 2 and something 8. 0, 1, 2. 2 and 2 eights. If you can simplify it, please do. No need to yet. Then B is at 2 holes and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 out of 8 parts. So I messed up again. <laughs> 2 holes and 5 eighths. Because it is asking for inches, please put two little marks. Looks like a parenthesis, end parenthesis. After that, that signifies inches. Anyway, that is drops in the bucket number six through ten. Good luck.